Silent, smooth, and swift. That's what the electric drive can do that BMW is showcasing in its high volume 3 series. The prototype of the future hybrid we tested, marrying electric and combustion engine power, is a plug-in edition. Our car tester Rainer Unruh wants to know what that laptop is about. The car is still in development, explains BMW's Stefan Praza. So he might have to intervene under certain circumstances, maybe even for Reiner's safety. The control systems might revert to fallback settings, but the technology is at an advanced stage, so he's not expecting any complications. Okay. The plug-in hybrid system achieves performance approaching 180 kilowatts. Beamer rates fuel consumption at 2 liters per 100 kilometers, equivalent to CO2 emissions of 50 grams per kilometer. The battery makes a vital contribution. As they accelerate, the reading is 250 amperes of battery discharge current. Okay. And now, when Rainer hits the brakes, that recuperates 120 amperes for the battery. Eco-friendly mobility is gaining importance. BMW's i3, already on the market, has a pure electric power setup. That's great for getting around megacities, but its road range is very limited. On the 3 Series plug-in hybrid, BMW is now offering the option of combining electric and gasoline power. Reiner is now in max e-drive mode. He's going to try driving down country roads at 120 kilometers per hour on electric power only and avoid kickdown. How long can he do that and is it always possible? What they can do is a typical urban drive cycle for 35 kilometers. Stepping up to 120 kilometers per hour on electric power will increase consumption a little. As Reiner correctly assumes, you have to work out how many kilometers that knocks off the range. They're now in the more balanced auto e-drive mode, which, as with other hybrids, means a speed limit of 80 kilometers per hour. Running on electric power is quite efficient at lower speeds. This is where the combustion engine will have a lower efficiency, and the benefits of a hybrid come into their own. Okay. Intelligent hybrid functionality serves to achieve the greatest possible overall efficiency. The driver can choose Max E-Drive to activate all electric mode. Save battery mode keeps the energy capacity constant. The primary E-Drive technologies and components are developed in-house. Production will start at the BMW Munich plant next year. But the car maker has another prototype showcasing hybrid technology, the 5 Series GT Power E-Drive. BMW engineer Philip Morrison takes us on a lap of the Circuit de Provence with the Power E-Drive demonstrator. We start out in all-electric mode. Then they switch to range extender mode for greater efficiency over longer distances. Finally, there's the combined system performance where the combustion engine joins in. Okay, good. Oh, wow. Wow, what's that? And that's all electric. That surge of speed takes them suddenly up to 140 kilometers per hour. Cool. The future Power E-Drive technology has a range of notable features, including the markedly higher output electric motors plus a double battery capacity. The new system's name will be one for Reiner to remember. He's impressed. It's called Power E-Drive. It boasts more electric fun at the wheel than today's hybrids and with no compromises in long-haul capacity. On these plug-in hybrid vehicles of the future, around two-thirds of the system output goes to the Power E-Drive system and one-third to the combustion engine. There's an electric motor on the rear axle putting out some 200 kilowatts, so that's a very powerful unit. The front axle has an electric motor and a combustion engine. This prototype has an all-electric range of up to 100 kilometers. In future, BMW is looking at a system output of over 500 kilowatts. 
plus the battery capacity of up to 20 kilowatt hours is far in excess of contemporary hybrid systems. Now they're running on electric combined with an internal combustion engine. So even more output is available. And that means being able to accelerate to 150 kilometers per hour in no time. So when will all this hit the streets for regular car buyers? BMW expects the system to hit the market in 2020, give or take a year. Power E-Drive technology can then see top-of-the-range plug-in hybrids leaving the competition in their wake.